Hey, this is Hal from Travel for Wildlife, and I'm going to introduce you to one of my favorite new gadgets. It's made by Wildlife Acoustics, and it's called the Echo Meter Touch 2, and it's designed for detecting bat echolocations. I am totally addicted to this little gadget. I use it almost every night to come out and listen for bats and I'm going to give you a real quick demonstration on how to use it to see what species of bat you have flying around your house. You basically just stick it in your phone. They make it for Android and for iOS, but you need the Echo Meter Touch app to go to the menu, choose Auto ID Selection, and then choose your geographical region. I'm in the state of North Carolina, so I'll click North Carolina. And I'm going to go to live mode. Once I'm in live mode, all I have to do is hit the start button. And uh, I'm going to start listening. So I'll see if anyone's around. I hear a bat. There's one really close by. Okay, now I can actually see some flying overhead there. See so here how they got really close together there. That means one is about to catch a bug. The echolocations get faster and faster just before they close in. So now if you want to record one of these sounds, you can just hit this little button here and it'll actually record backwards about four seconds or something so you don't miss the call. It will automatically run an ID program to let you know what species of bat it was. And in my case, it's the big brown bat. I can hit the info and I'll get a picture of the bat. There is the little cutie. And I can also go to the Wikipedia page and find information about the big brown bat. So there's all kinds of cool things you can do in the spectrogram here. And I'm going to change the listening mode to time expansion. It basically slows it down to one tenth or one twentieth of regular speed. It's so much fun. I am addicted to using it and I think you'll love it too, so go check it out. I don't use Tinder. I use the Echo Meter Touch too. I find all my friends that way. <laughs>